What is up, YouTube? It feels so good to be back. It has been a long time since I've been able to make any videos. Been a lot going on, been a lot of changes, but they've all been great. Uh, but I'm going to get back on that grind of editing videos. I have been herping all summer and all spring. So we are going to continue with the last episode of Herping North Carolina with Ben, where I found some absolutely amazing snakes and had some awesome experiences. I'm super excited. Does it get this video out for you guys? And I hope you enjoy. Today, me and Ben have traveled to the Outer Banks where we're hoping to find some different snake species today. We're looking for king snakes. We're looking for hog nose. Obviously, we'll probably get a lot of bycatches. Also, I'm super excited to see what all we're gonna find today. The weather is perfect again, just like yesterday. And hopefully we can find some awesome snakes so I will keep you updated we're gonna be hiking to a uh, sandy oceanfront area with live oaks which is areas that hognose really like to hang out so I'm super pumped to see what all we're gonna find a king snake we hiked the king snake we oh hiked, my gosh oh my we hiked the king snake I can't believe it hold on don't move if he starts darting I'm gonna jump look at that look at that king snake that is amazing. That is the, got him. Oh my god. gosh. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Guys. Beautiful. They're so beautiful even in shed, like wow. Wow. That's insane. It's definitely one heck of a way to start the trip. Beautiful coastal king snake, chain king here in North Carolina. Wow. And the first king that I have ever hiked. He was just chilling on the side of the path, about one third of his body exposed. Just basking. This weather is perfect. We're really hoping for a hog nose today, but even if not, this already has made for a great day. We're gonna do some good photos of this dude. And keep on herping. So this right here, guys, is a beautiful eastern king snake found here in North Carolina. Just such an amazing animal. The weather is really perfect king snake weather. A lot of times when it's really cloudy and partial sun and cool, these guys will be out on the crawl, which is exactly why we found them. But really, three king snakes in one trip is just fantastic. To find a king snake, like literally two hours getting into herping is also even more crazy. We still have a lot of potential coming up here in a minute. Uh, so we're gonna send this guy on his way and keep on herping, but Look at that. He's dipping. At least this beautiful chain king. Oh my gosh, it's so gorgeous. There he goes. Wow. Such a beautiful snake. Let's keep on herping. Look at these views, guys. Look at these views. Such cool place to be looking for snakes. Nice lizard, oh my gosh. Yes, absolutely quality find and cool lifer. This one by Ben, he saw another little twitching in this random grassy clearing, is our first glass lizard. Such cool animals. These guys resemble snakes, but they are lizards. What else do you know about them? I, I'll pause it for a second, I'm trying to think. They're such awesome creatures. I might've heard of them. Really interesting habitat. Very interesting habitat. I just love exploring new areas. That's the second quality find. First the king snake, now a glass lizard. Who knows what else is in store. Look at that beautiful patterning. Oh my gosh. Such cool animals. One way they differ from snakes is they have external ears right there. Yeah, almost looks like they have and a broad-headed skink. Yeah. And they love just like this random grassy area. Where are we going to release them? Probably in the grass. You ready? Yeah. Gorgeous lizard. There he goes. I wasn't recording, but Ben chased a racer up in a tree, and we got him. I might get some photos of this dude, because it's really cool. He's not typically black like all the other ones. He's like derpily gray. See you later, buddy. There he goes. Yes, that's what we came here for. Oh my gosh. Oh no, he's fainting. Still, oh my, oh god. my gosh, we did it. Fly for hognose. Oh Holy my gosh. gosh. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. 
We did it. We were hiking another one of these things and we did it. Oh look, he got hurt by something a long time ago. Wow. Oh my gosh, yes. Yes! We were hiking this little grassy clearing, kind of like where we found the glass lizard. And I came across this hog on the crawl. It's awesome. Insane. This is what we were targeting. We've got a king snake, a glass lizard, and now a hog nose. Who knows what else is in store? I knew the weather was perfect for these dudes today. Now this dude has definitely seen his fair share of uh, battle scars. He looks like he got away from some big predator a while ago. And he's definitely close to being in shed, but I am not gonna complain. We got what we came here for. Better look at him. He's came alive again. Such an awesome looking snake. This is exactly why we came to this spot in this area. Beautiful. Really, this day has been one of the best, maybe the best day of the trip so far, and it is one of the last days. Such an awesome snake. We're gonna put him back in the grass and keep on herping. We've just been hiking grassy edges like this, and that's where the snakes have been. Just slowly walking through this grass. This is so cool. Tenth Where'd racer? he go? He's right there. T tenth racer. We got another racer in the tree. We chased gonna... him up the tree. Vin chased him up the tree. We're gonna leave him in the tree. That's so cool though. Look at that. What number is that? 11? 10? 10. Roll up. That's so cool. Another racer. This area skull. is so dense with snakes. There oh. he goes. 11? I wasn't recording again, but I, just as I was talking about racers, got another one. Crazy. Another more grayish one. Oh, it's huge. It's huge. Oh, my gosh. Oh, holy crap. Did you see how big that was? 15th racer. How big was that? I stepped on a cactus too, ow. 19 or 18? Yep. 18. Got him. This one's black like the normal ones. 18, I think, yeah. Wow. Number 18. <laughs> <laughs> that was absolutely insane to find a king snake, a glass lizard, and a hog nose. Mm -hmm. Today, I really hope you guys enjoyed me chasing running down racers. <laughs> we hiked through like three miles of crazy intense habitat just to find those little dune clearing things and that's where all the snakes were at. Yeah, snake tracks. I've never seen that many snakes in one day. That was insane. Plus those two quality snakes sprinkled in. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoy uh, Adventures with Ben's Derps 2004. And I will catch you guys when I see the next. Ah! We're on the road. You see a D-O-R, Ben. Road, road.